What's going on, beautiful people? It is I, your favorite dimply chocolate best friend, and I'm back with another video for you. If this is your first time watching my videos, hi, my name is Rika. I make videos here on YouTube about a 15-year life change journey that I've been on where I am on a quest to better myself in every sense of the word. If that sounds like something you'd be interested in watching, click subscribe, turn on your post notifications. We instantly become BFFs. When you do that, you get extra BFF points if you share any of my videos. You tell me about you in the comments. I tell you about me in the videos. We share love between one another. We support each other on this quest to be better humans. Happy Happy Friday, beautiful people. It is currently not Friday for me, but it's Friday for you. So happy Friday. I hope you are having an amazing day. Um, I am recording a what I eat in a day video. So um, it is already <laughs> 2.12 and I have not eaten a thing, uh, but I usually don't eat until about three o'clock. Um, that's the intermittent fasting window that I'm in I do three to ten usually three to nine because most of the time I stop eating after eight o'clock honestly uh, but I might have like a graham cracker or a cookie or something after that but either way um <laughs> it is currently 2 12 and I haven't eaten anything so um, I'm gonna just take you guys along with this food that I'm going to take in today I have no clue what I'm going to do but um yeah, we're just going to do what we do, okay? So usually I start my day with taking medication. I have to take a thyroid medication early in the morning. Then an hour after that, I take another medication for COPD, uh, as well as lymphedema and an allergy pill. So I take a few medications in the morning, as well as two inhalers. And then usually a couple of hours after that, I'll take an apple cider vinegar capsule. I can't do the liquid don't suggest it okay but yeah I take that and um I take a multitude of other supplements but uh it's just like multivitamin zinc things like that so uh those are really not important but I do take apple cider vinegar usually a couple of hours after I eat so I just took that at about 145 so um yeah that's usually how it goes but I got my day started very early today because I knew I was going to record this video usually I'm just now working out and doing what I do in the middle of the day because I'm just not a morning get up, work out, drink coffee type of girl. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, so I'm going to show you guys what I eat today. And uh, yeah, so here's the breakfast. <laughs> Don't know what it's going to be yet, but we're going to figure it out. Okay. Okay. So this is going to be breakfast for the day. I'm going to start. Oh, let me show you the, the kind uh, strawberries and cream. These are the nutrition facts. So this is going to be breakfast and I'm probably going to have some popcorn. I told y'all I'm addicted to popcorn and this is one of my favorites. Actually, this is probably my favorite. I like the kettle corn. So yeah, and just in case I decide to get one of the others, two cups, 140 calories, 70 calories per cup. And then this one is the same, but you get two and a half cups and it's got a little bit less sugar and uh, stuff like that. In it. So um yeah i'm probably gonna wash it down with some kind of popcorn and uh yeah that's breakfast editor rika here to say that i did in fact have a serving of the skinny pop popcorn i was not able to record it because i was on a phone call but i did take a photo of it it was about 30 minutes after i had the protein shake so yeah okay meal number two is a salad i don't like lettuce with my salad so it's literally cucumber tomato chicken a tablespoon of bacon bits and a stalk of green onion i'm going to top it with this local um house italian here are the nutrition facts on that if you care about it and yeah that's meal number two okay so prepping dinner now um this is some chicken breast that i seasoned with lorries a little bit just a tiny bit um, this is onion powder and of course garlic powder and I use some fresh cracked black pepper to season it with and I also put like a tablespoon maybe a little bit less than a tablespoon it was probably about a tablespoon though um, because I didn't technically measure it into the chicken I'm gonna let that marinate for about 45 to an hour and then I'm gonna prep my vegetables and we're gonna get to cooking it's gonna be good editor rika here again to say that in the next clip you will see me making dinner in that pot is a dish called chicken chop suey it is traditionally made with chicken but it can be also made with beef and pork it's a local dish here that you can get at most of the asian restaurants i started making it at home to cut back on some of the calories and some of the msg as well as some of the um soy sauce that they use in the dish so yeah i just wanted to preface this clip by saying that enjoy the video of course, I forgot to show you how the process of making dinner because I started making it 
without my phone in my hand so uh that didn't remind me to <laughs> record but i'm gonna show y'all what i'm working with so all right so this is what we're working with this is chicken celery onion and bean sprouts that's pretty much all you put in this and you make like a brown gravy for it that you mix with some soy sauce so um i didn't mix much soy sauce because i marinated the chicken in it so i might have put maybe another tablespoon and a half in the actual brown gravy mix um and you just serve this over rice and the rice is now done so you know we got i'll be doing about a half a cup of rice and about maybe a cup of this and i'll show you guys what my meal looks like when it's done right. this is my food let me move the chopsticks this is my food for the night it's a half a cup of rice and a cup of the stuff i'm gonna wash it down with some the rest of my zero sugar powerade and yeah that's dinner okay beautiful humans that is it for the day that's all i had it is now 11 34 i stopped eating somewhere around 8 45 9 o'clock uh the last thing that i had which is what i just finished uh, and it was very cold but i had some peppermint tea i usually drink this before bed because it helps kind of calm my stomach after all the meat and stuff because we're still working it out without this gallbladder thing but it's going to be fine we're doing everything we can but um yeah i showed you guys everything i had other than the fact that i tasted um two well i've had them before but two of the toffee tastic girl scout cookies i did have two of those with my tea so i did forget to um recording that because i was talking to my mom on the phone but i did consume those and yeah so i'll put the total calories for my day right here um and that's what i got today um i was shooting for 1500 calories so i haven't inputted everything so i'm not sure if i made it but if i didn't we'll try harder tomorrow uh it's been really difficult for me to get to 1500 calories my goal is ultimately get back to 17 1800 uh but i'm just not hungry <laughs> you know what i mean i'm just not hungry and so you know, I'm trying to work with myself, but I am pushing because after surgery, I was taking in about seven, 800 calories. So, and that was a struggle, you know what I mean? So yeah, we're trying. That ends this video though. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little glimpse into what I eat. It was probably very boring, but it's fine. You know what I mean? It's fine. But yeah, thank you for watching. I appreciate you guys. I hope you are doing amazing and feeling loved. If not, I love you so very much and you are so important to this world. Please continue to exist because I need you to be here, okay? Take care of yourselves because if you don't, no one else will. And I'll see y'all on Monday. Peace.